Alright, so... Where do I begin? I just want to make sort of a gameplay mechanic video of this game, Dystopia, because it's not a popular game anymore, and if you see a video on it and you don't know what the hell is going on, you're not going to want to play it. So, I want to get some players for this game. If even five or ten of the people that watch my videos join up, I'll be happy. So, let's get into this. This right here, whatever, get some ammo. Um, this is a big portion of the game it's about cyberspace you're like your own little entity in it you have your your energy which is that blue meter on the bottom left there uh, so see this right here is an ice barrier okay so in cyberspace you can toggle all sorts of shit like right there toggle turrets you can have defenses um, access there that's nice you know whatever so I did something in cyberspace now some some people might actually fight me in there and just to show you what the attacks look like um, yeah, let me get out in a little more open space all right so this right here I'm just gonna left click that's a basic beam you know a, a hit scan attack you, if I scroll down and then use my mouse one again, I have like a pistol, like a scout pistol type. And then my right click, which is like a soldier's rocket jump. But, you know, it's like a rocket, basically. But you can go all over the place here. Anyway, all of that consumes energy, and when you're in cyberspace, you're fighting with energy. Like, that's everything. It's your ability to do things, it's your health. And if somebody gets you to zero energy, well, you're out of the game. So, um, that right there is a thermoptic turret. It can see through stealth targets. Uh, bunny hopping is a big deal in this game too. You really, got to be able to move. You know. Anyway, so. Let me just complete a little uh, objective here. I'm not playing with anybody because I want to be able to explain everything. I'll, I'll probably make more play videos of this soon, some gameplay. Alright, so shut down package processing, whatever. Um, when you're in cyberspace, you can set little protection things up to kind of slow down the enemy team. Like, right now I'm a punk, but if I were, uh, you know, the core, I would want this protected because I want to be able to get here and fight for it. I don't want this guy capping this point. So I'm going to use this now and I'm going to get the objective. Objective captured now. That leaves two more main objectives. So now the spawns are moved up kind of like in Highlander, well six is whatever, any competitive thing. We have a laser right there and the objective is to go into cyberspace and hack the laser so that it blows up like a hole in a wall or something um, so right here I'm going into cyberspace but my body is right here in mate space so we're gonna have a team of guys who will just kinda be here watching over me just protecting me and if they fail to do so I'm gonna die all it's gonna take to knock me out of cyberspace is this little grenade somebody throws that successfully then I'm fucked I'm just back out in the meat space, all my senses are fucked, and just so that you can see what this looks like, look at this. So, uh, I can't really see stealth targets, I can't use any of my implants, so there's no cyberspace, no stealth, no seeing stealth, no heals, none of it. And that lasts quite a while, anyway. So I'm gonna get the second objective, and then I'll show you a really cool part of this map. Keep in mind that two, uh, two teams here will be fighting. There's always people in cyberspace ready to fight. It controls cameras and everything. Okay, so I realigned the laser. Let's go watch this. Okay. 
Okay. Derp. Anyway. Now these things here, in this particular map anyway, um, the objective is for the punks to destroy all eight of these, but they're not actually out. You have to sort of bring them out now. So what we're going to do is, firstly, the punks need to capture this area. You need to hold it as territory. You need to lock these upper doors so that the uh, core who spawn generally back there, they can't come in here through the top. So they're going to be coming in from down here. You're going to need your team to hold this entire area down. Um, you know, you're going to have to deal with stealthers and all that shit. So let's see. Uh, we might have somebody stand on top of here with the door closed. Um, we might have another guy with light boosters jump up there, uh, kind of like soldier perch spot. And we're going to have another guy right here. Open storage unit, and it sort of comes out like that. Let me open all of these. And you can close them here too, by the way. This is um, where the core would go to if they take the area from the punks. It's kind of like a struggle for the area, your territory. Okay, let's see. All right, we're good. Um, so now, open this. And now all these data stores are open, and the punks have to destroy them and whatever. I'm almost already out of pistol. There we go. So... As you can see, this would take a while, so the other uh, option for capturing this is to simply protect your Decker inside, and if you can protect him for a whole minute, then you'll cap it like this. Okay, so here we are, and it's saying 60 seconds ETA, locking down data stores, establishing connection, whatever. So, now this is coming out. This is all just pretty in lights and stuff, but the guy has to stay alive in here without dying in meat space so that this can happen. Uh, if a guy sneaks in, so much as throws a grenade at you, then you're pretty much fucked. But, you know. Just kinda floating here. Now, my teammates would be outside guarding me. They'd be probably blocking the door from grenades. Whatever the hell they have to do to keep me alive here, they're gonna try and do it. And a good push is going to wipe that. So, you know, obviously it's gonna take strategy there. Um, after this, I'll show you some of the classes and weapons and stuff. It's kinda neat though. I like it. Objective successful. Alright, so there we are. So now with light, let's just go there. You have your sh typical shotgun, whatever. Um, whatever I spawn. It's kind of your scout scatter gun, really. The difference is, unlike scout scatter gun, where you can only shoot one shell at once, if you right click, you're shooting two shells. So you have a whole double barrel thing going on, and that's nice. Do it, whatever. That was just a little demonstration. Let's see what other weapons I got here. We got laser rifle, which I was playing with earlier. Ugh. And what this is, it's it's a sniper rifle, but you actually have to charge the beam because it'll charge down on you, just like that. I didn't I've been holding mouse one down this whole time. 
and you have to actually get that headshot at the exact right time so that it one hits somebody or you know like a mid or something you can still get a pretty decent one shot on a scout with pretty low uh, charge but this gun works best from a distance because for some reason distance uh, factors into damage so like if a scout was like right over there and I would one shot him but if he's like right in my face like right here I'm not gonna do a goddamn thing to him um, you have your pistol too whatever saw this earlier it's pretty decent you can't there's only one type of pistol obviously to, um, I wish there were more secondaries like in TF2 but whatever so you have your sword here you can block you can swing whatever uh, when you block somebody they sort of get stunned for a couple of seconds like they can't swing at all and then you can just kind of hit them but let's what else do I have I love my explanations Now, all three classes get four different weapon choices, so right now we're only on Scout, the light class here. So we got the bolt gun, which can also do headshot damage, it's a projectile. When I right click, it'll do that right there, so I can make that happen really quickly. It's like, sort of area denial, it's a pretty good weapon. And then, we have the smart lock pistols, which are some of my favorite. I think I've used them in a video before. And what these do is like, you know, they're kind of like Counter-Strike but you can just sort of hold them down and they'll spam. Uh, but if you right-click, they'll kind of shoot this locking thing at them. I, I don't know what it is, like an auto-target thing. You actually have to hit them, but like if a target's right there and I'm aiming here, it'll still hit them with every shot. So, you know, it, it's like aim assist as long as you get your first shot correct. Um, anyway, let's go into some heavy. Or mid, actually, let's do mid. Medium Tesla rifle. Ugh. All right, this is kind of a weird gun to show. Um, when I just hold down left click here, this is what it's gonna do. It's just, it's kind of like a mid-range sort of automatic damage weapon, you know, like a rifle, but, you know, then there's this, which is really fucking cool, and you don't get to spam it, but, you know, every 5-10 seconds or so you can shoot it off, and yeah, it's an awesome little weapon there, what else does mid get, um, oh, they get a little demo man pipe thing, Make sure your interp is zero, by the way. Okay, so I got demo pipes, but just watch the arc. They don't really work the same. Like, I'm, I'm, aiming, ah, I'm aiming straight here, just perfectly straight, whatever. But they shoot up like that, so they just kind of have a, have a weird arc. Like, they just go up and then straight down, so it's not really as easy as it is, it is with demo man. Fuck. Actually, can I rocket jump with these? Pipe jump. Fuck. Did they explode? Oh! Okay, right, right, right. If you right click, they'll actually explode faster. That's cool. Okay. <laughs> That's kind of cool, actually. Alright, um. See what else I get. And these are pretty self-explanatory. Let's look at the heavy, though. The heavy is really fucking cool. Um, <clears throat> let's see. So we have a rocket launcher here, and anything that your red dot is aiming at, the rocket will go to. So. Let's see. Notice my movement speed, by the way. I'm fucking slow. Yeah, pretty cool. And it has to 
charge up though, because this is like a heavy duty. Fuck somebody up.